I want to put the camera somewhere else today. I like how you can just see the fan going in the back. Yeah, got my car. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly what I was trying to say. <coughs> so. <laughs> it's been brought to my attention by many people over the course of my life that I am of below average size. <laughs> I mean height, okay? Dax, what is your opinion on my height? Okay, family friendly, thanks, jeez. What about you, what do you think of your height? I think you're short. <laughs> Ew. But I, 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 I don't, yeah. <laughs> I don't think there's anything wrong with being short. Some of the best people are short. Danny DeVito. <laughs> Robert Downey Jr. is short. I mean, he's not that short, but he's short enough for them to make him look taller in front of other actors. Uh, who else is short? Oh no. Um. Oh no. <laughs> Mario. <laughs> I'm not. No, I am. I am. <laughs> I am five foot one and a quarter. That's kind of short. <laughs> and it doesn't help that my posture sucks. Is Mario already short? Mario's kind of short. I just in life I don't think I'm that short like being short has never been a disability <laughs> but I find most teenagers I meet not teenagers but like tweens like 12 and 13 year olds they're all at least my height or taller by like five inches I, I don't know what it is I feel like nowadays people just look Older, not people, teenagers. Kids and teenagers just look older than they should and are taller than they should be. Yes. Am I the only one? <clears throat> the only one what? Be specific. Am I the only one who thinks that this generation and like the past few generations look older than in the past? Who cares? Especially at work, I notice it. I work with quite a few short girls though. They're all older than me. They're all older than me. I'm literally the youngest at my job. So there are these guys, these teenage guys, these adult guys, who are tall. And I am not. So just walking through a bunch of people being as short as I am, it's scary. <laughs> Going back to... 12 year olds. When I was 12, I'm pretty sure I was a solid four foot eight. Wait, maybe I was probably smaller. I, I know that at some point in my life, I was stuck at four foot 11 for, for y years. <laughs> maybe not years, maybe two years. I was four foot 11 for two years, maybe longer. Yeah, because I think I went from four foot eleven, and then the next time I measured myself, I was five foot one. So it was a few years later. Yeah, because in between, my father measured me, and he was like, "You're almost at five feet." And I'm like, "You been saying that since I was 13. <laughs> and I, I, guys are obviously going to get taller first. Guys are taller. That's it. Guys are usually taller than girls. My family is fairly short. My older brother's definitely shorter than the average male. Either that or he's like average height. Average or a little bit under average. I think for the most part, all of them, when they were like 12 or 13, they surpassed our mother's height, which is 5'3". Five 5'3". Three. Five three. Yes. And my younger brother, who is 12, is taller than me now. And I'm not surprised. He likes to rub it in my face, even though I'm like, did you, what? Why is it an accomplishment being taller than a five foot one girl? It's not. My youngest brother's only six, and he's probably gonna be taller than me by the time he's 10. <laughs> Recently, I went to Canopy Lake with friends. And this time when I went, the workers didn't have to stop me every time I tried to get on a ride. You know the sticks that they hold? Like, they're they're F's because there's two. So, uh -huh. And the last time I went to Canopy, I think I was 13. I think I had just turned 13. And I'm pretty sure I was still, I think I was still 4 foot 11. Which I think is just tall enough 
to ride any of the rides. Any of the rides I want to ride. Any of the rides that we rode. And they stopped me with every single ride that we'd be walking. And then they put the hand out for me to stop. And I'm like, huh? And then they hold up, to, hold, hold a stick up to me. And I'm just standing there while my friends are watching and laughing. They're not my friends anymore. <laughs> but this time, I think it was more apparent, a little bit more obvious that I was tall enough. <laughs> it's also very interesting being very high in the air when you're so small <laughs> because you're not even used to being six feet off the ground. <laughs> There are only so many jokes you can make about someone's height, you know? So every time someone brings it up, it's like, come on, get all the jokes out, you know? Like, when are you gonna lean on my head to make a point? My older brother does that and he's only a couple inches taller than me. <laughs> I do know of some people who tower over me and they don't make jokes, not anymore. <laughs> it is kinda nice though with, in pictures, I always get to be at the front and I'm a little bit more eye-catching because the size differences. Mind-boggling. I'm just so used to it, it doesn't seem short anymore. But then, I stand next to other people, and dang. <laughs> dang, boy. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Ow! See, this is, this is reaching. Before I wasn't reaching, I just put my hand up and swung it forward with a lot of confidence. But I'm kind of stretching a little bit more. And I can still barely touch it! Ah, uh, that's tippy toes. Oh, yeah. That hurt. <coughs> Hello? Ooh, I can barely tickle it. Excuse, stand back. I don't want you to get hurt. Yeah! <laughs> uh, I think it's funny to enter a room like that because some people, like, I like to do that. I like to just walk by and smack at the top of it. But of course I have to hop a little bit, or at least tippy toe. But it's funny to just enter a room with full confidence, go for it, and just completely miss. <laughs> I need a tape measure. Where's a tape measure? I don't have tape measure. Where's a ruler? Why, who, why do people steal my rulers? Oh, I found it. Ruler. Typically, typically foot long. <laughs> and a ruler. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, this on top of my head would be six foot one. The camera's at an angle, so it looks kind of funky, but that's fine. Okay. <laughs> you know, as you grow up, you your parents measure you and put like a mark on the door frame. Um, usually, kids' marks would be like there, and then there, and then there, and then so they're. Mine are just like. <laughs> I'm just about 11 years old now. Here. <laughs> and then, oh, girl spurt. Fast forward a couple years. I was at like this height for the longest time. <laughs> if I put the ruler in half. <laughs> Most people I know who are taller than me are only a couple inches taller than me. Half. This would be. Hello? Do you guys enjoy working? Yes, James. It's lovely. <laughs> What's half of 12? Six? This is six inches. I folded it in half. <laughs> I am 5'1. So this on my head would be 5'7. This is so pathetic. <laughs> I'm gonna put the stand on the camera as it was intended to be. Shut up, James. <laughs> James is my boss. <laughs> it's a drawing that my brother did for me. He says you're welcome all the time for it. <laughs> I look so small. This, on top of my head, is almost out of frame. Is it out of frame? This would be I said it a minute ago. <laughs> Five foot seven on top of my head. Top of the head, right there. <sighs> now again, most of the people who are taller than me, who I didn't expect to be taller than me, while they're still not even a teenager, are like five foot three, five foot four, sometimes five five. I have a cousin who's 20, 
20, and student give me 21, and she is my height. Almost exactly my height. Maybe an inch taller, maybe not. It, I feel like every time I stand next to her, I'm just looking at me in like five years in the future. Who else is short? That's cool. Me. <laughs> Levi Ackerman. So yeah, in conclusion, I just wanted to address er what literally everyone I know has already addressed. My name is Patience. Sounds weird, I know. And I am five foot one. And I'll probably always remain five foot one. Maybe I'll get to five foot two. That's a nice even number. Have a nice day. And as always, how's the weather out there?